for all who have vowed themselves to God, the Pope, bishops, priests, and religious, that with his help they may faithfully keep to their resolve. We pray to the Lord. Hear us, O Lord, for we call on your name. Hear us, O Lord, for we call on your name. Peace among nations that delivered from all turmoil, the people may serve God in freedom of heart. We pray to the Lord. That the Lord may be pleased to show himself as a father to our deceased brothers and sisters, friends and benefactors. Grant them the reward of their labors and welcome them into the light of his face. We pray to the Lord. For the elderly who suffer from isolation or sickness, especially for our sister Aura Rodriguez, the daughter of the founder of Dr. Rivera's Gold School in Nairobi, that they all may be strengthened by our love of them as brothers and sisters. We pray to the Lord. For ourselves gathered here, for those who could not make it, and for all who worked hard to make this occasion a meaningful and fruitful experience, that as God does not cease to sustain us with the things of this life, we may know how to use them in such a way that we may hold them even now to the things that endure forever. We pray to the Lord. Colleagues and staff of Dr. Rivera Gold School, who have accomplished whatever was entrusted to them in this world with responsibility, we ask to reward them with everlasting life and light. represent all of us gathered here from different parts of the world to celebrate this Memorial Eucharist for all those gone before us. May our togetherness spread to all around us like the fragrance of these flowers. Through these serials we express our concern for the many deprived of May our own offering enable us to be generous, not only with the things we possess, but also with our time for all those who knock at our doors. Through this bread and wine, we offer you each and every one present here, so that just as the grains of wheat are crushed and the grapes are pressed, to make one bread and wine, we too may allow ourselves to be molded and melted into your image and likeness and bear witness of this world in which we live, have and move our being.
at the time he was betrayed and ended willingly into his passion, he took bread and giving thanks broke it and gave it to his disciples saying, take this all of you and eat of it. For this is my body which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice and once more giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. Behold the Lamb of God, behold he who takes away the sins of the world, blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word, and my soul shall be healed. 